You asked me about how do I track my face while well, I flying. You see, I don't move the mouse. I don't use keyboard to move my head. It's very easy. It looks like VR, but it's not VR. I don't have any captures on my head. It's very, very easy. Let's go. So welcome to the cockpit of the A320. This is my third aircraft of Phoenix Simulations Block 2. So what do we need if we want to move not like this, like uh, with the keyboard and uh, the mouse? We need uh, two things. First, we need the phone and uh, better is if you have iPhone because the application that we use for the tracking is uh, using Face ID for better uh, quality. And the second one, we need the application called OpenTrack. So let me show you. This is, uh, you can see it here. This is application is on my phone. It's called SmoothTrack. So I, if I open this application, you can see me here, it's tracking here. And uh, that second thing we need is this application for the PC. Very important thing that uh, our phone must be connected the same local network like our PC. For example, my PC is connected by the cable and uh, my phone connected by the uh, Wi-Fi, but the same local network. Let's go to the smooth track and hit the start button. I need to sit in front. It's calibrated like two seconds. Now it's okay. So you need to take a right position with the, your head looking at front for a few seconds. As you can see, my face is already tracking for my phone. And now we can hit the button of the open track. And our head start moving. If you want this thing working well, you need to know two important things. First is the light. You must have enough light in your room. Uh, as you can see here on my phone, it's tracking well because it can see my face. If you uh, fly in darkened room, you, you have only darkness, you can see your hands, uh, you cannot capture nothing. The second one, the second thing is the settings of the application. So I, what I did here. We go into the options, filters, I did this. Smoothness is maximum, dead zone is zero. Uh, the same is exactly, the second one is the same. Smoothness is maximum, a dead zone is zero. Uh, when we go to the shortcuts, I use uh, these two buttons for the center and toggle tracking. What does it mean? For example, one and zero, look. Uh, for example, we looks at the left side, but uh, the, my head is in front. I need to turn center to back to the front. So first I hit button number one and hit on the mouse number one. Like this, you see? So the first button is red center. We need to see in front of us. We just hit button. The second button is uh, to off the track motion. So, for example, I go into CDU. I don't need again a track motion to move in my head. I will just close that by hitting button zero. So that's it. Now we can use all what we want without using the tracking or enable it again to stop and enable. Very easy. I will show you now what do I have on the sensitivity of the application on my phone. The X axis is 100, the Yankee axis is 1.86, and Zulu is 100, Yao is 158, Pitch is 160, and Roll is 100. That's it. It's very if it doesn't work at all, you need to check a website, official website of this application, Smooth Track, and how to install it because there is some important things like Windows Defender. If you will search on Google like install Smooth Track, you'll find the first link here with this setup. And uh, this man is owner of that thing, will tell you everything step by step what to do for to make this works. See you next time in the sky. Goodbye.